First of all, it's always good to see you. How are you doing? Everything is good, Mike. It's a pleasure. See you again, my brother. She's with me since the beginning, and uh, it's a pleasure to talk with you. Yeah, we go back a long way. Yeah, back in the days, the Swiss, you were, you was here. When no one thought Verdum nobody, gave him a chance. Nobody, and I was the first place just here, you know, yeah. our grand opening. And then back after five, six years, five years in my opening, and then back today with, you know, you saw a great training, you know, good person be here, good fighters, and uh, it was a pleasure to see you, man. Thank you, brother. It was a special day today. Uh, BJ Penn was here and talk about that. was a great experience for me. I'm a big fan of BJ since the beginning. He style everything that you can see inside martial arts today. It's not just about the, 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 his techniques, it's about fight spirit, you know. He always come to kill or die. He fought against the best guys in the world and today he gave a lot of inspiration for the guys inside with his words and to make people, all those guys, you know, pump pump for, to fight and uh, make people look a different way to, to fight. Make people realize what you have to do to be a champion. What is your favorite BJ Penn moment, do you think? I think when he beat Kaoru Uno was the beginning, the thing. was a great knockout when he beat uh, Sean Shark with the knee. And then he throw one, two, three, he say, no, he's out, he's out. I could, then it's the fight, you know, something, man, I can kill you, but uh, I don't know. I just let you go, and that's it. He, he did great fight. He fought against Lioto Machida. So the history talk for themselves. He big, fought against big guys in the world. And, uh, you know, it's a pleasure. Do you think BJ would have fit in at a gym like this under your tutelage? A second place. Do you think that BJ would have fit in at King's Zone? For sure. He's mm -hmm. our spirit, you know. He think about fight the way you think about fight. He's old school, you know. And uh, never give up, always, you know, kill or die. I think make you be jail what, he, what you can see today, you know. Do you see any resemblance in Rafael dos Anjos of BJ, like the same type of fighter, killer? Ah, for sure. BJ, when, as soon as he talk, stop talk, Rafael talk good things about him. And uh, he was a great inspiration for Rafael dos Anjos too. And uh, it's nice to see people, for example, BJ has a, ba a good background in Jiu Jitsu, but his spirit is fighter. You know, he world champ, first guy, world champion, first American world champion. And, uh, you know, he have a history not just inside Jiu Jitsu, not just inside MMA, but inside Jiu Jitsu too. He's a big motivation for guys like as Rafael dos Anjos, UFC champ. When Rafa talk about BJ, his eyes, you know, you know, almost cry because he know when he talk about martial arts, he talk about BJ.